Variable data printing means printing that uses a database to create individual prints that each include unique data. Addressing envelopes at the same time as printing them with a return address, logo, and other graphics is an example of variable data printing. The IQ Workflow software lets you produce variable data printing very easily, but first you must have a variable data file. IQ needs a variable data text file in what's called a delimited format. If you are the print provider, your client should provide this file to you since it probably includes their customer data, for example, names and addresses. If you are the owner of the data, your data probably exists in some form of database or spreadsheet. Whatever application you use to maintain this data, such as Excel, Access, pre-sort mailing software, or any customer data management solution, probably has some way to export the data in delimited format. This means that each data field and record in the database or spreadsheet will be separated from the next by some sort of character. Usually, it's a comma. This type of file is called a comma separated value file or CSV. Let's take a look at an example of data that is in a spreadsheet. Your application may have different controls than this, but should be similar. To export this data to a delimited format, we click on the File menu, then select Save As. In the Save As window, there is a drop-down field for file type. Clicking on the drop-down displays a variety of different formats for saving the file. Most applications will have a choice for text or CSV. Picking this choice may provide you with options for different characters you can use as a value separator other than a comma. In this application, we can pick from several choices. We'll stay with the comma character. And click OK. In the application, the data appears to look the same, even though the format has changed. If we open that same file in a different application, such as Notepad, we can see how each field has been separated from the next by a comma. To use a variable data file in IQ, the separator character must be one of these, comma, tab, semicolon, colon, or vertical bar. Once you've created the delimited data file, importing it into IQ is simple. Open your job ticket and click on Add-ons. Then select Variable Data from the drop-down. Browse for your data file. Click Open to import it to IQ. You'll be able to see your data in the Field Preview pane. Each individual data field has a unique field ID number. If you can't see your data or if it appears all in a single field as shown here, your data file may have a separator or delimiter that's not a comma. The default separator character for IQ is the comma, but clicking on the field delimiter drop-down displays the different choices. Picking the correct separator that matches your file will make the data fields display correctly in the preview pane. Once you have your variable data imported into IQ, you're ready to begin laying out how you want that data to appear in the job.